Grace and peace and salvation is free. But let's pause and just breathe through his death we're relieved. But deception inception's embedded in dreams. So let me reflect the king and tell you how he resurrected this beast. Searching for peace in a world that's so peaceless. I was enthralled with indecent acts of immaculate meanings. Identity events left me searching and seeking. But I searched me in secret and it led me to reason. The morals of a heathen but justified them through works. My filthy rags were better. Well, they were better than yours. So what would it hurt if I did a little dirt? Said some words to a person and didn't care if they burnt. Spiritually speaking, I was rare, even worse. Uncooked to the bone, I was lukewarm since my birth. No desire for God, cause I was my own Lord. What good has God anyways if his story's a folklore? But all that I hoped for, fled away when my knees hit the floor. This friend I called the world, nah, I didn't want it no more. But how did this happen? I've been in Christ all along. I even went to church and I even sang the songs. I said a prayer to them all and they saw what they saw. Full submersion through baptism, how could I be it wrong? But listen, my sin had me gone. My sin had me gone and my motives were wrong. I only wanted Jesus if the payback was strong. But then somebody told me that I couldn't gain nothing. Every act that I thought meant something, it really was rubbish. So sick to my stomach, I realized what I wanted. I saw what is sundered for me, but I deserved to be punished. Listen, it wasn't the physical vile cruelness of the whips or the crown of thorns of harsh words from Pharisees' lips. It wasn't the nails that pierced through his wrists, but the wrath of God being poured out for the love of his kids. Listen, he took the cross out of love and compassion, and belief in this action is all that is asked of us. His grace is enough and his cross it is matchless. A relationship with Christ equals complete satisfaction. His glory is great through my struggles and pain. And I pray that I view that my death is my gain. If that's what it takes for these souls to be saved, Lord, use me as a vessel to share your saving grace. Repent and believe.